Do you all guys know this, right? People actually respect things and literally appreciate loads of stuff. This is how, right? So do you all guys know when you're just say I'm gonna say this word, right? Phrase. Just say if you're spoiled, it's like oh god, I go out every single weekend. This flash like two hundred quid into town there, get a taxi back and all there. Oh god, I spent like so much money on shoes, clothes here. I'm going out to another festival tonight. There now, I'm going to go to another festival for for six months there every single Saturday. There, brilliant stuff. Amazing, absolutely amazing. Amazing. So all those um festivals you're going to, oh god yeah. And then the next year after that, the next year after that, the next year after that. Do you know what to save your money and all? No, I don't really want to. Why do I like saving it for a car or your your own property or someday with your girlfriend or or future wife or whatever? Nah, this party and all and this that the other day. Sure, look, I'm gonna have all this um. Um, money back anyway when I get, when I'm doing college and all or or even not even do college at all just uh, work my ass off there and splash it sp splash my month's wages on partying basically and then what would happen then you're splashing all this money there this that the other right and you're earning and then you're splashing earning splashing earning splashing so you're technically working for nothing whatsoever. Right, got am plus well if you're going on holidays there on your own or with your with your girlfriend or whatever it is you're splashing so much money not on her now but like on yourself there in a fancy hotel, this that the other and all and then you you come back on your flight there. But what happens if just say your parents are gone, right? And then, so, how much money do you actually have there? So you'll be checking there, of course, in your bank, obviously. And you'll be like, hey, carumba, I won't be going out any much longer, that's for sure. I need to fucking start saving, like, I need to appreciate, like, a 10 euro there. You should be like, like, oh my god, 10 euro? 10 euro? Oh my god, it's going to buy um, milk, bread, um, butter. It can buy, um, it can buy you a dinner. True. A dinner or even 50 quid or 100 quid here yeah. how much do i spend in one night i'll get a 200 quid 200 quid that's what half a month's um shopping monthly family shop actually with 200 quid wow yep all that money there and you have to you're splashing all that into dublin town and now what you're doing is you're appreciating all your money because you're parents are gone they're like that and they actually appreciating what you have at the moment aren't you yes you are exact same thing when it comes to oh god yeah i'm driving my dad's car there oh yeah my dad takes it takes care of the insurance and uh my mom takes in care of the whole house cleaning and washing and all that kind of stuff and now who has to do it you have to insure your car there with a big ass fucking engine and tax and all that uh, and then the house housework and all cost a fortune yep oh yeah yep so technically you actually had it easy when they were alive very very true actually yep so what you doing now these days well, to be honest now, I'm, I'm actually um, appreciating every single thing, really, to be honest. Every single thing. If I buy a brand new car that's only a year old there, I'd be like, oh my god, this fantastic car. So if it gets any scrapes, I'll go mental. But when if my mum and dad got me one, like they always do, right, I can scratch the living crap out of there because they'll buy me a new one, you know? And especially a house. God, I just... I had to remortgage the house there just to pay off a few uh, bills uh, that I owe uh, people there. Well, my mum and dad owe to the bank, whatever, that shenanigans. So, yeah, like, Jesus Christ, it cost a fortune. It does. Like, I'm appreciating every single thing. Like, even eating ham sandwiches there, I appreciate it. 
buy a pair of shoes out of um, the popular brands there. I appreciate it. Oh, oh, you worked hard for that now. You deserve it. Go on, spend me. And then you spend that there. And then you take care of those shoes. Absolutely, you would. You know? Like, you wouldn't be going out in the mud what, what happened a couple of months ago. To say if you wait, when your parents are, are uh, gone there, you'd be like, oh, yeah, remember those days there my parents bought me piles of shoes and all, but now they're sadly they're gone. And now I have to, like, if I get one scratch or one dot of paint on my shoes, I go ballistic because they cost 100 quid. 100 quid is a lot of money, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, I remember when I spent it all in them. Um, in um, some place in Gimneys there. Hey, caramba. And now I'm spending it on a pair of shoes. Jeez, 200 quid, 100 quid is a lot of money. I think you'd be appreciating, or even if someone actually gave you a couple of quid to buy you a pint there. It's like, here, I'll buy you a pint uh, there. Do you want anything there, uh, friends? No, no, no. Just for him. Okay. All right, let's buy him a pint. And then I'd be like, there's your pint. So I'm just going to pretend it's right, your pint. Here's your pint. Oh my god, a pint. Oh, wow, this gorgeous pint up to the top and everything. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's good to be out now with my mates now for one night. God, I'm appreciating it all. I remember I was going out every single weekend, but I'm bored. I caramba. God, my life is in misery. I caramba indeed. You'd be literally like that. You know what I mean? Like, you be appreciating everything that you earn out of your own uh, wages there. Could be sh minimum wage there in that big old house there. You're paying off the mortgage that's uh, left over there. And then you'll be paying your car and all there. It's like, Jesus. That's, that's very bad. God, I wish I could have like the normal uh, lifestyle back. Yeah, well, now it's the real life now I'm in the real life it fucking sucks but do you appreciate your your things and everything there yes I that goddamn do and your parents will actually say the exact same thing to you like think about it right you scratch the car right what happens then they'll literally get a baseball to your head literally you know that kind of anger because they spent their hard works earned on that car that cost 30 to 40k in one year you know what I mean for that car there and what you do you scrape it you know what I mean they'll go mental over that because it's coming because the parents paid for their own car and then there's the child scraping along there like that you know what I mean you know what I'm trying to say they appreciate everything there even the house there you may not uh, think it ho oh, ho by god what do you think if uh, people's um, houses get burgled there? They go mental. I just spent a fortune on that front door. Now to buy a new one. Yep. Yeah, goddamn fucking robbers. Or even that goddamn burglars there smashing my fucking windscreen again. <sighs> That's the third time that happened this year. I only bought it. Jesus Christ almighty. Thanks very much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. If you can, it's just possible.